My name is Chris Ray and I'm the Managing Director of the AES Engineering Limited Group. This is the third in a series of video diaries to promote our commitment to invest £29 million in environmental projects by 2029. In this video we're going to talk about Scope 1 and Scope 2 emissions for the Global AES Engineering Limited Group. We have estimated that the total Scope 1 and Scope 2 emissions amounts to 4,500 tonnes. We have therefore bought 4,500 tonnes of CO2e offsetting, we believe that our Scope 1 and Scope 2 emissions for our global business will be net zero for 2021. So what are we actually doing to reduce those emissions? We are putting solar panels and batteries into one of our largest buildings that we own, which is in America. I'm visiting America next month to look at the possibility of building a minimum three acres of solar farm because in the future we want to have our own offsetting scheme. We are looking very seriously at the potential to build a solar farm in India. Our business in Germany is investigating the use of air heat pumps and solar panels and batteries. Anywhere in the world where we have a large enough building, we're going to reduce the amount of electricity and gas that we use. We're also considering investing in forests. And whilst we realize that people will say, well, the forest existed, so how does that help emissions? Ask why the Brazilian rainforest is now emitting one billion tons of CO2 every year when it used to absorb 1 billion tons of CO2e every year and the answer is if you buy a forest and maintain a forest it is better than cutting the wood down or burning it down. In the next video we're going to talk about scope 3 emissions for our global business but our company is absolutely working to ensure that we avoid emissions in all of our global business. Thank you.